Alright, welcome to the video. You've read the title, you know what we're doing. Let's uh, let's start at the beginning, hey? Plan is to jump off of one of these cranes and parachute onto cargo. This one here. Those two are just a bit too far away. Nice. <laughs> Pro is running around forever. So, to keep it simple, I need a tier two, a gun, ammo, meds and of course the parachute that's the goal we're doing nothing else but farming for that after crafting the tier 2 i went out to farm some resources The plan was to go deeper into the snow, but as you saw, my train got stuck. I had a feeling this guy would also get stuck, so I snuck forward. Get this fuel to the train station. Come on, man. Can we work something out? I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Can I take your gun? I I'll give you everything else back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take everything. I'm just trying to. This train keeps getting stuck here. The one in front of this train. I just want the fuel. <laughs> hmm. Nice, man. Cheers. All right. Well, got a gun. Not the most rust way to get a gun, but a gun is a gun, right? All right, let's research this shit. Yeah. Tier two, gun, meds, ammo. All I was looking for now was the parachute and then I'd have everything I needed for cargo. My plan was to go to train yard to do the red card puzzle so that I could get some more scrap. But before I could even get out my front door, I got a notification on the bottom of my screen. Bruh, cargo ship. Oh I needed to God. get scrap for this parachute, quick smart, because I only had about 20 minutes before cargo would be in my harbor. Guy there. And then, in the red room, I pulled this. Awesome. Parachute! Well, I guess it saves me some scrap. I need to research this quick spot. Parachute. This is what I'm the most excited about. I needed more tarp and sewing kits to craft my parachutes, so I took some spare hazies over to supermarket to recycle them, but I got a bit more than I bargained for. Oh, 
the backpack does. Is it shape again? Ah, oh, feels bad. It was the same guy I killed earlier at the trains to get my gun. He lived nearby and he seemed cool, so it didn't feel right to take his stuff. Hey, um, Shape, is that you? I've, uh, if yeah. that's you, Shape, I've left all your shit there. I didn't take anything. Sorry, man. Ah, oh, thank you. Who is that? Or it's, yeah, it's Lidl. I live down the, uh, down the road. Did we run into each other before at the train? Yeah, yeah, we did. Oh, oh thank you, bro. I was just, the last oh, good, thing man. I was doing before I jumped on for the night. You're a legend, bro. All good, man, all good. Nice, nice. See, that feels good, man. Took a little bit of his metal and took a syringe, but... Alright. Just on the way down. I'm fucking nervous, man. Oh, shoot. I'm keen. I'm keen. I'm keen. I'm keen. It's showtime. Let's do it. This is why we have spare kits. I want to try and get some I don't know why I jumped off cargo here, but I did. One parachute left, right. so this was it. Third and final attempt. Alright. I mean, just leaving, right? Final horn from cargo means that it was leaving, and for some ungodly reason, I thought I had any hope of getting on, but I didn't. Is there a chance? What I didn't realize at the time was how long I would have to wait for the next cargo to respawn. The wiki says two to three hours, and at this point, it was like three in the morning. I would have to wait until the early hours of the next day if I wanted to try and catch the next cargo, and so I did. This is me on my phone sitting in my chair in base, waiting for that notification to pop up. That is a big change. You should be proud of that. You have every one of my team. Joy in this moment is me. It's in. Okay. Okay. First things first. Which harbor is it closest to? Oh, bless. Dude, it might even go straight, straight to this one. Oh, uh, it might do the full lap. It did the, it full, did the full lap. lap. So, once again, I waited. However, this time to keep myself entertained, I went and counted the train yard crate. Here are some highlights.
and my gun box was now looking like this. I was more than ready. It was time to head back into harbour for round two. Start opening these crates. It's been around the map a full time. Things are gonna start happening soon. The um, radiation's gonna set in, all that bullshit. on the server right now. I actually was one of the only people on the server right now. Remember how I said that I had to wait yeah, three yeah, hours for this cargo? It was currently 6 a.m. And all Australian Rustified servers restart at 6 a.m. This actually meant that I needed to speed run the hell out of this cargo. If I could kill all the scientists before the reset, there's a good chance I'd still be alive when I log back on. that this cargo did in fact reset. The first crate unlocked and I got my hands on my very first <laughs> minigun. What better way to test it out than on this counter? To crank out the mini gun, eh? Come up. Don't be nervous, please. Okay. Now I know there's an underground bit, so now I am now. There he is. He did board right at the end. Let's go home. 
That was a cargo and a half. Save the planet. Straight back to my wooden ship. Nice. What a run. Have a look at it down there. That's insane. Whoa. That's going to conclude this video, because this video was just trying to parachute onto cargo. I did that. One cheeky counter raid. Counter, counter, counter. And I got the minigun. That's a bad boy. But I think I'll have to give this one a try in the next video. So until next time.